Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I wanted to talk about engineering. Is it really that hard? Now before we get into the video, I just wanted to say thank you for 1,000 subscribers. I kind of started this as like a hobby and it turns out, I don't know, you guys like hearing me talk about engineering or something. So thank you for that. In celebration, I wanted to have a live stream either this coming Friday or next Saturday. Let me know in the comments below which day works for you Friday night or Saturday night so it would be Friday night or Saturday night for me and since I'm in Switzerland that is probably around 4 p.m. Eastern Standard Time so let me know which day works better for you so let's get into the video is engineering that difficult and my answer to this is it depends I've sort of broken this down into three different levels so the first level is it depends on what you define as difficult so for example for me I find writing very, very difficult. I just don't have that creative, like getting the right words. Maybe it's because English isn't my first language or whatever, but I find that being able to pull thoughts from my brain and organize them into a readable manner is really difficult for me. So for me, I would actually say that a course like political science or history would be, I can't even imagine doing it. It would be way too difficult for me. Or another thing is memorization. I have terrible memory, terrible memory. I would never want to do biology. The only thing I remember is the mitochondria is the powerhouse of the cell. And I know that plants and animals have two different types of cells. The plants are square and the animals are circular. That's the only thing I remember from biology. And I can't imagine having to go through a degree where all I'm doing every single day is writing down notes and memorizing the notes. That's not my thing. That is too difficult for me. For some people, that comes naturally. They would rather do that than try to understand concepts in physics and try to solve problems. So for me, something that I find out of these three categories a lot easier is I find meditating on a concept in physics and then once I understand it, having to solve problems using these concepts, I find that a lot easier than the other two options. So I think it really just depends. What are your strengths? Are you really good at using your words? Or are you really good at memorization? Or are you really good at problem solving? For me, I'm in the last case. I love problem solving and it is my strength. So therefore, I already find that engineering is easier than those other two types of education. Now, say you are in the same category as me and you're a problem solver. Is it difficult? Yes and no. Once you get past all of your required courses for university and then you have to take your technical electives in your last year, you can choose to take easier courses. I took a class called Carbon Capture where the first three lectures were about oil, gas, and coal, just about the history and whatever and how many reserves we have and how long they're gonna last and how long it takes for coal to form. The other three lectures were on climate change and then the last few lectures were on carbon capture. So that's not a very technical class. It's sort of just concepts that you should know if you're in the field of carbon capture. So you can take courses that are easier in engineering. And then there are courses that are a lot more difficult. For example, if you take a combustion course, or if you take a turbulence modeling course where you have to learn how to close the Navier-Stokes equations, these courses are a lot more difficult. So if you're already a problem solver, is engineering difficult? It depends. You can take courses that are easier or you can take courses that are harder. You can challenge yourself. But of course, within each of these courses, there are some problems that are easier, some problems that are harder. The last thing to remember is that no problem is too difficult to solve. Some people think engineering, I could never do that. It's too difficult. No, you've just given up. I'm sorry, but for example, in programming, there's this myth in programming that you can either do it or you can't. Myth, I'm telling you, you can do it if you tried. When I first started programming, it was difficult. I didn't really understand it. Other people gave up. They said, oh, well, I've heard that you've either got it or you don't. I don't think I've got it, so I'm not even gonna try. I refused to accept that I didn't have it, so I kept doing it until I understood. Now, my master's thesis has to do with numerical simulations. That is my life. I don't believe in this, you've got it or you don't, 
People that say they don't have it is because they've given up. They didn't want to even try to figure out programming. There's no problem with an engineering that is too difficult to solve. Of course, there are some problems that your profs are gonna give you and they're really difficult and you've only got 15 minutes to solve them on the exam, but everyone in the course is in the same boat as you. You're gonna come out of that exam wanting to cry and then everyone's gonna laugh hysterically because you're gonna realize no one could solve that problem. <laughs> on the exam. So in conclusion, if you think that you are not really good at writing or memorization or whatever, and you think that you're really good at meditating on concepts in physics and math and then using them to problem solve, then engineering is not more difficult than any other field. There are challenges in every field. Thank you so much for watching this video, guys. If you liked it, then please leave a thumbs up. If you have any more questions, leave them in the comments below and please subscribe if you wanna see more. Remember to let me know what day you want the live stream to be on. It'll be a Q&A where you can ask me all the questions you want related to engineering and related to this YouTube channel, its purpose, whatever, Friday or Saturday. 